Hey, what's up world? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, today for you, I'm going to be doing a little unboxing. Uh, what do you know? Another unboxing, I know. I, I promise you guys I'm going to have some fist catching videos uh, uploaded soon. I just need to edit them. Uh, but I, I promise I'll have some, some good actual fishing content. Uh, but this just isn't any regular unboxing video. I actually uh, entered a giveaway on Instagram that Optimum Baits and Depths put on. Uh, it was like a product shoe or fish catches using their products and uh, I won. What do you know? I, I never win these fish. Actually, I take that back. I actually have had a lot of luck with these fishing giveaways. I think this is my second or third this year. So uh, I don't know why I was thinking that, but I take that back. So I've had actually a lot of luck this year. And uh, yeah, I wanted to share with you guys what I uh, got from Optimum Baits in this uh, contest. So let's just throw open it right up. Pretty heavy and a lot of rattling in there. All right, what do we got here? Oh, looks like a banner. Hell yeah, that'll go real nice on my uh, pegboard in the garage. Boom, depths, nice depths uh, tarp banner. That's gonna look really cool hanging in the garage. Style of Depths. Uh, if you guys aren't familiar with Depths, uh, it's one of those uh, JDM companies. Their stuff is not cheap, super high quality, really cool paint schemes, uh, really good hooks on them. So I was super thrilled to hear uh, I won this giveaway because this is like a $400 uh, value. So there's a, there's a lot of baits in here and uh, super pumped to see what we got. All right. First bait, looks like a, it's a really big jerk bait. It's a, 130 millimeters, so this is probably, I don't even know, I don't even know what that is in uh, inches, but uh, really big uh, jerk bait, the Balasong Minnow 130, it's a rolling jerk bait, boom, that looks super sick, that's going to be good for uh, the winter, oh yeah, really good rattles in there. Doesn't say how deep it goes, it's all in Japanese. I'm gonna have to have one of my uh, buddies uh, read this. Tell me what it's all about. All right, nice little jerk bait. Oh yeah. Nice frog, the Buster K frog. Really unique design, the, uh, the legs on it are like feathers or fur. I like that little poppin' frog, Buster K. I don't know anything about these baits, guys, so I'm not gonna like do a breakdown or anything. Um, yeah, not familiar with it, and it's all in Japanese, so I don't even know like the weights or the depths they dive. Uh, but super cool. Oh yeah, another frog, the Slither K. This also has like a, a feather, or, like fur type fox tail, uh, like feet or paddle on it. Non-stop dog walk. Natural fur tail, no tuning needed. The Slither K. And for all I know, I'm gonna look these prices up, but it's Depths, it's JDM company. So uh, these are probably all like 15, 20 to $25 baits. Definitely not cheap stuff. Uh, so super cool. And then we got another frog. The uh, Bassersky, the, bur the Bass, yeah, the Bassersky, soft, crawler bait. It's a hard belly plate system frog. Looks like it has one hook on it. Interesting. Huh. Wow. Keep that. All right, all right. All right, we're getting some hard baits. Nice uh, square bill here, the Evoke 2.0. Oh yeah. And that fire tiger, can't go wrong with fire tiger. It's a good looking uh, crankbait right there. Oh yeah, some good rattles in there. I haven't fished really into their uh, hard baits. I, I really fish, well, I have like a couple of their swim baits, the slide swimmers, uh, but I primarily fish their soft baits like the Depths Bull Flat and the Spiny Craw. Uh, really high quality stuff. Um, Here's another little finesse crankbait called the uh, 
Corrigan SR. Really cool paint scheme on this. It's got some black with uh, gold in the belly or like a bronze. Really like that color. Good little finesse crank. I dig that. That's my favorite bait so far. Ooh, what is this? The Buzz Jet. Oh yeah, so this is like a top water uh, prop wake bait. Really, really big. Super loud, a lot of a lot of knocking in that bait. The Buzz Jet. Really like that paint scheme as well. Bluegill color. All right. Here's another, it looks like a jerk bait. Oh, no, 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 it's, it has like a jerk bait profile on it, but it's got a uh, prop on the back. So I assume this is a, a top water. Um, it's called the Spiral Minnow, Minnow Form Noisy. I wish I had like inches and uh, ounces because I don't know what these things weigh and, and how long they are. But I really like this paint scheme. It's got, it's all black with a navy blue nose and a pearl eye. Super sick. I'm digging that bait right there. Looks like a good night bait with the prop. I assume it's a surface top water type walking bait with a prop. Super sick. Oh yeah, that's noisy too. That's gonna draw them in. Super sick. Wow. The tension of detail on these things are just amazing. Super cool bait. All right. Wow, the NZ Crawler Junior. I've seen their regular crawler. Looks like a, I don't even know, like a catfish or a puffer fish, and it's got some wings on it, so it's a crawler. I don't have any, so I'm super pumped to fish this. This will probably be the first thing I fish. Uh, I might go do some night fishing tonight, so I'll definitely throw that if I get out there. Weighs one ounce. It's about three, three and a half, four inches in a uh, bright gold color. Super sick. I like that. That's my favorite now. Boom, the NZ Crawler Jr. All right. Ooh this is this is badass. The tiny bowl shooter. Super cool. As you all know, they're they're super known for their uh, bowl shooters and slide swimmers. This is the tiny version. Uh, so, you, so you won't be so timid throwing this type of uh, glide bait. It's a little glide, gill glide profile bait. Uh, I've seen the uh, regular size in person and super lifelike and got a really good action underwater. Uh, I really like that. It only weighs one ounce, so you can throw that on conventional gear if you want. Boom, the tiny bowl shooter. Looks like a realistic gill color. Oh yeah, that is sick. Really like that. Hmm, look at this. The Gurkha knife. Looks like a big spoon. Or like one of those vertical jigging type baits. I don't really do this, but this will be good at uh, some of the big bodies of water, especially in the winter. Weighs two ounces. Doesn't have a hook on it. I got some hooks in the uh, garage. But uh, that'll be good in the winter and get a, get a spoon bite. I don't really fish spoons, so this is cool. A lot of these things I don't fish, so this is a great giveaway. It's getting me out of my comfort zone. Really unique baits. I like that. World record holder. He uh, created this, and uh, wow, hopefully I can uh, follow his footsteps. <laughs> really like that. Sick. Two ounces. Throw this like on a heavy uh, jig rod. Or even like my swim bait rod or something. Perfect, I saw a Tactical Bass and they just uh, uploaded a, uh, a spoon uh, video, so I'll definitely tune in for that, get some tips, because I'm not familiar with spoon fishing. And then the uh, last bait. Wow, a lot of baits. The uh, MT Wake, the Jointed Cover Wake Bait. Oh, this is badass. Wow, so many unique different baits. Uh, it's an all black uh, wake bait. Weighs just under two ounces. Oh yeah, a lot of noise. It's got like a little uh, prop on the back or a spoon on the back. I'm sure it flutters on the surface. That's sweet, wow. All 
right. How many baits did I get? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve baits. What a freaking giveaway. This is freaking awesome. Wow, a lot of new toys. Can't wait to throw every single one of these. Uh, yeah, won this all on an Instagram giveaway. So um, if, you, if you have Instagram, enter those. Cause uh, you'll be a winner and sitting pretty like how I am now. I got a you know full brand new box of uh, tackle. Uh, saved me a little bit of money right there. Uh, my girlfriend will definitely be happy with that. But uh, anyway, so um, yeah, I'm glad you guys tuned in for this unboxing. Uh, like I said, I'm definitely going to be uploading some more fish catching videos, um, so tune in for that. If you like this video, give it a like or a thumbs up, and uh, if, you, if you feel so gracious and want to see my future videos, hit that subscribe button. I'm trying to tr grow this channel for you guys so I can share my fishing adventures uh, for you guys' entertainment if you're bored at work or just at the house and you can't get out on the water. Uh, so thanks again for tuning in, and I will see you all on the next video. Peace!